I am Top Orlando Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. We're at 2916 Vine Street, Orlando, Florida, 32806. In the subdivision of Crystal Homes. So this is one of these subdivisions near downtown. You really wouldn't know what the name of the subdivision is. The nearest cross street is Curry Ford and Crystal Lake. And the purpose of this video is to give you what you can't see. If you look at the best pictures posted online on Realtor.com, Zillow, Trulia, Homes.com, how do I know? Because I'm the one, no matter where you look, who took and posted those pictures for sure. So I get a lot of calls from people saying, what's it really like? What's the neighborhood like? Middle of the afternoon, on a weekday. And the only way to answer that at those trees to so walk through and have you get a chance to look at a couple of the neighbors this is definitely a neat opportunity four bedrooms three baths pool needs a lot of work some renovation some of those ones you do it be worth a lot more the neighborhood close to downtown the hospitals Hard to replace. The three rules of real estate, location, location, location. They're right next to Curry Ford and Crystal Lake. It's the place to be. No homeowners association. Talk with a lot of buyers every day. I don't think I hardly ever have anyone say, and I want a homeowner association. So there's none here. You can see down at the end of the street there, that is Crystal Lake. The intersection of Crystal Lake and Vine. Can't hear any traffic whatsoever you take a home like this which is a lot like our subject property this one's just got some paint some nice siding so I'm gonna plant some flowers and the value is gonna be well north of a hundred thousand dollars more just for making it nice so if you're thinking about buying this one and fixing it up you're gonna have to buy cash people say it gonna look like in the end is it worth it when we got these older neighborhoods there's definitely some rentals there's definitely some really nice homes in here this is almost for sure owner occupied look at that same original footprint original floor plan someone cares about their landscaping cares about their yard at the nice st augustine it's a pretty neat house and you can make one much better if you're even thinking about buying a home down here near downtown orlando or in the orlando area i want you to call me i've been listing and selling homes like this every day full time for 32 years there's 18,000 realtors in orlando right now and i have sold more homes in 32 years than almost any realtor in our board there's nothing that hasn't come up that have been dealt with successfully Kind of like if you needed major surgery, only it was free. Because working with a realtor to buy a house is free. It's like if you needed major surgery, and you could get someone who's done thousands and thousands of operations. Everybody's happy. You can look them up online, like you can look me up online on Zillow. Or you get some new agent or some new surgeon. Well, he seems like a nice guy. Let's give him a shot. No, nope. get someone good. So across the house, that's there. There's our neighbor, and again, someone takes care of that. That St. Augustine lawn, nice care, and of course, there's no way to halfway fix up a house. So when we see this house in a couple of minutes, you're going to fix it up even nicer than most of them on the street because you can't halfway fix up something. You can't have paint, you can't have carpet. You can tell it's a lot of people who care about their house right here in the neighborhood. And that's what you would see if you're from out of town and you flew into town to see this one. I'm saving you time. If you're thinking about getting a house, you know the market's really, really hot right now. Most things are selling 
really fast. Why are they selling so fast? Because you're calling an agent like me, I'm going to set you up on my website and make sure that I send you exactly the kind of homes you're looking for. Exactly. Someone working on their house right now. And then you're going to get notified the day they come on the market. So you can go out and look at them or call me about them right away. And that's how these people who are trying to look online and see a house 10, 15 days in the market. Seems new. It's already sold. So let me get you the inside scoop. And again, it don't cost nothing. All right, we're coming up on our subject property here. You can see the neighbors. Got that nice, expensive St. Augustine grass. This one does need a little work. Grass is okay. Four bedrooms, three baths. It was built in 1956, 2,235 square feet. And the slab, including the back porch and the garage, is 2,860. No HOA, and the taxes are only $1,809 a year. If you're coming from New York, you're feeling like you're paying $1,809 a month, for instance. So the house is a Federal Pacific panel, which has been here since the 50s. The original panel has worked just fine. However, it does need to be upgraded for insurance purposes. You're going to need electrical, you're going to need a roof, probably you're going to end up resurfacing the pool. The pool obviously looks good, working well, some screens in, and then all the things you do to a normal renovation, flooring, paint, fixtures, change out the little electrical switches. You can see the basic house, the size of the yard, the big shed, pool. This is just made to be cleaned up and turned back into something gorgeous. Got that siding, which is really easy to paint and take care of. Go around back front. On the way out front, we're here in the pool. You can view the backyard. Look at that cactus. That cactus is probably 20 years old. Siding looks good, just a little discolored. There's a Marsite side. And Tells people spent some time and some money doing some things. Gives this a nice feel. Okay, now we're walking up to the front porch. View from the front door. And we say, welcome home. Pretty big house with a lot of living area for sure. Everyone wants a big kitchen. Ooh, there's a big kitchen right there. So when we're talking about doing a renovation, it is some major deferred maintenance issues. The roof, the electrical, maybe the AC, stuff like that. But most of it's just clean up. Like, how old are those? Just change those out. These are solid surface countertops. Cabinets are newer. You could definitely work with all this. Just like it is. And now we go into a huge living room dining room, fireplace the size of a wall, it's 
master bedroom through that door. There's the pool. This is some big rooms. Isn't that cute? Bay window just made for plants. Got your view of the pool right here. That's a pretty picture. Got your pass through. This living room, nice floors. Can't even buy floors like that anymore. And then we've got this room, which could be a formal dining room or an office or another living room. Of course, it's under AC. You can see multiple living areas, multiple sides of the house. This is ready to handle a pretty big family. Got the garage, just as you'd expect from a garage from a house built in 1957. Like at one time, it could have been a carport that they enclosed. Perhaps. Just because of that, it makes me think it's a carport. At one time. It's nice now, oversized. Room for washer and dryer, right there. The AC leaked at one point. No door cover there. Easily put one back. AC does look newer. So we're going to zoom through here and go check out the master suite. This is an addition sometime in the recent past. And what a huge room! My God. We put three king beds in here and still have room for furniture. And look at this bathroom. Someone really, really wanted a great shower just like this. We've got the tub with jets, which I bet is not working. And you've got this amazing shower right here. Got a seat, it's inset, design well, pretty cool. Got your throne room, double sinks, granite counters, new cabinets. Again, really easy to work with on a renovation. Just lots of details. That's the door to the outside. And now for the bathrooms and other bedrooms. All right, we're in the hall here. Again, you've got that nice wood floor, which you may not be able to save. I'm sure that's from the AC leak from a long time ago. Got the little closet. Nice big bedroom again. This is the original master. So there's two master suites.
And all this needs some work. If you can tell by the tile work, you can't buy tile like that anymore. That's got to be original. If you can work with it, bring it back, keep the old charm of the house, that would be amazing. Look how cute that narrow little closet with the gorgeous wood floor in the bottom. All right, we got the last bedroom. So if you're even thinking about this house or a house like this, I need you to call me, top Orlando realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. Let me help you with this. I can do it just about like no one else can. See, a lot of this has been redone already. Just need someone to come in, buy it cash, love it, make a fortune. 407 339 3200. My information is attached to this video. Call me, let me help you too.